Soyuz TMA-22 was a manned spaceflight to the International Space Station ISS. TMA-22 was the 111th flight of a Soyuz spacecraft, and transported three members of the Expedition 29 crew to the ISS. The spacecraft docked to the ISS on 16 November 2011, and remained docked to serve as an emergency escape vehicle until its undocking on 27 April 2012. Soyuz TMA-22 successfully landed in Kazakhstan on the 27th of April 2012, 11:45 Greenwich Mean Time. TMA-22 was the final flight of a Soyuz TMA vehicle, following the design's replacement by the modernized TMA-M series. The launch of Soyuz TMA-22 was originally scheduled for the 30th of September 2011, but was delayed until the 14th of November following the launch failure of the Progress M12M resupply vehicle on the 24th of August 2011. Soyuz TMA-22 was the first manned mission to dock with the ISS since the retirement of the American Space Shuttle fleet at the end of the STS-135 mission in July 2011. Topic: Drew. Topic Backup Crew Topic Mission Profile Topic Rescheduling of Launch Soyuz TMA-22's launch was rescheduled from late September 2011 to the 14th of November due to the failed launch of the unmanned Progress M12M cargo spacecraft on the 24th of August 2011. The incident was caused by a blocked fuel line leading to the gas generator of the third stage Rode 0110 engine of the spacecraft's Soyuz U booster. After the loss of Progress M12M, all Russian crewed spaceflights were temporarily suspended, due to the similarities between the failed engine and the third stage engine in use on the crewed Soyuz FG booster. A Russian commission blamed the Progress M12M failure on a single human error, and put additional procedures in place to prevent the problem from recurring. On 30 October 2011, Russia successfully launched the unmanned Progress M13M cargo spacecraft atop a Soyuz U booster, clearing the way for the Soyuz TMA-22 launch. Topic Launch Soyuz TMA-22 was launched on schedule from the Gagarin start launch pad at Baikonur Cosmodrome, Kazakhstan, at 4 hours 14 minutes and 3 seconds Coordinated Universal Time on the 14th of November 2011. Soyuz Commander Shkapelrov sat in the Soyuz's center seat, with flight engineer Ivanishin strapped into his left and NASA astronaut Burbank sitting to his right. The Soyuz FG rocket carrying Soyuz TMA-22 was launched in blizzard-like conditions, with high winds and temperatures as low as minus 5 degrees Celsius Nonetheless, conditions were deemed to be within acceptable parameters for launch, the rocket followed a nominal ascent trajectory, and successfully inserted Soyuz TMA-22 into orbit approximately nine minutes after the launch. 
Once in orbit, the spacecraft deployed its two solar panels and communications antennas as planned. Topic. Docking Soyuz TMA-22 docked with the ISS at 5.24 Greenwich Mean Time on 16 November 2011, about nine minutes earlier than planned. The spacecraft docked at the MRM-2 Poisk module, while Soyuz TMA-22 and the ISS were flying 400 kilometers (250 miles) above the Southern Pacific Ocean. The Soyuz crew entered the ISS at around 6:39 Greenwich Mean Time and were greeted by Expedition 29 crew members Mike Fossum, Sergey Volkov, and Satoshi Furukawa. Burbank, Shkapelrov, and Ivanishin received congratulatory satellite calls from Russian dignitaries and family members before participating in a safety briefing led by Expedition 29 Commander Fossum. Topic: <laughs> Deorbit. Soyuz TMA-22 undocked from the ISS on 27 April 2012 at 8.15 am GMT, carrying Burbank, Shkapelrov and Ivanishin, and landed safely near Arkalik, Kazakhstan, at 11.45 am the same day. The spacecraft's departure ended Expedition 30, and left astronauts Oleg Kononenko, Andrei Kuipers and Don Pettit aboard the station to begin Expedition 31. <laughs> 